What's up guys, Fahad Zaman here. In this video, I am going to show you how to transfer iPhone files like music, photos, videos and more between your iPhone and PC with IO Transfer. It's an easy to use iPhone transfer software that helps you manage and transfer files between iOS device and PC. It also allows you to send files between iOS device and your PC over Wi-Fi without being plugged in. Besides downloading online videos to your iPhone and enables you to convert videos into various file formats including audio formats. First go to IO transfer official website to download it. Download link is available in the video description. After downloading, install it. When your installation is complete, launch the software and connect your iOS device via USB cable. Right on the home window, you will see how many files that are on your iOS device categorized into sections, music, photos, videos and contacts. You can directly transfer any file from the iOS device to your Windows PC right from here. Simply click on the transfer to PC button and select the file you wish to transfer. When you click on the details option on the iPhone sketch, you get to see a rundown of how your device storage is being shared by your apps, media files, etc. Click on the manage option to access all the files on your iOS. The steps for transferring music, video or photos are similar. Select the photos you would like to save from iOS device to computer and click the export icon. All selected photos will be transferred to PC in a few seconds. To import photos, click on import and choose the photos. All selected photos will be added to your iOS device. IO transfer allows you to transfer music files between PC and iPhone. Click on the import icon on the top. Select the music files. All selected files will be added to your iOS device in a few seconds. The IO transfer lets you clean up junk files and caches that are occupying reasonable space on your iPhone. Click on the clean option and further click on the scan my iPhone button. This tool will analyze your iPhone and show you the number of junk files to be deleted which you would have to click on the clean my iPhone button before. It would trigger the deleting process to keep your device free and save you some space for reasonable file documents. Besides transferring videos, another great feature is online video downloader. You can use IO transfer to download videos from YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter or other similar video sharing sites. To download online videos using this software, simply copy the video URL from the website and paste it into the provided space. Click on download button and wait for this tool to analyze your video link and automatically trigger the download process. The downloaded video will be saved. You can transfer the downloaded file to your iOS device within a click. For videos to be compatible on other platform, you can convert videos to another format. Click on the converter option. Further click on the add files button to add your video or audio file. Select the new format you wish to convert the video. Here are many supported formats. Now click on the convert button. What's more, 
both video downloader and converter provides an option to directly transfer the target file to your OS devices which is very convenient. If you do not wish to use a USB cable to connect your iPhone to your PC, you can stick to this option. Make sure IO transfer is installed both on the iOS device and the PC. Open the IO transfer mobile app. Allow the transfer to scan and search for the iOS device. Click on the iPhone name once the software detects it and click on allow. Once set up, you can easily transfer files from PC to iPhone wirelessly. It's very easy to use and time saving. At the end, here is also a new tool Instagram downloader. You can easily download Instagram photos and videos. Just copy the link and paste here and click on start downloading. So that's all for now. If you guys enjoyed this, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel for more amazing tech videos, comment down below if you have any question. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.